All right, here's our 2010 Puma, made by Palomino, uh, 30 DBSS for sale. It's got an 18 foot awning on it, no rips, just had it open, cleaned it up the other day, looks nice. Tires are in good shape, we didn't travel a whole lot with this travel trailer. It's aluminum siding, it's got no hail, clean title. Uh, one of the nice features as we come around to the back of the camper here is this Puma Den. This opens up to give you access into the quad bunk area. And so this bunk here will actually flip up and give you a nice storage in here so you could store, heck we stored small bikes in there or a grill, lots of lawn chairs and all your camping accessories. So that's a nice feature that comes with this unit. As we come around to the back, only thing I'll point out here is it does have a receiver hitch uh, with the wiring on it. So we didn't really use it to pull anything. We mostly used it to uh, put a bike rack on there so we could fit all five bikes for our family on that. But if you wanted to pull a jet ski or something that needed the lights and the wiring is all there. So it's a nice add on. Outside shower, there's your hot water heater. Everything's functional in the camper. Um, had everything turned on this spring. The water pump, the furnace, the fridge. Um, air conditioning, furnace, uh, I think I said that twice, but whatever. Uh, lots of storage underneath the, the tables and the benches, underneath the sofa. And then when you get up to the front of the camper here, here's the pass-through storage. So this goes all the way to the other side. Oh yeah, there's the weight distribution hitch, the sway bars, and all that comes with the unit. And then that's the pass-through storage, it opens up all the way to the other side. And as you come around the front, you can see that it's got uh, two 30-pound propane tanks. So you can see them there. I'll pull the cover up. Okay, I think that's about it for, for the unit.